what goes through my mind and my body backstage before a production. So many things, it's such a great surge of energy. Every cell in my body lights up, it's like it gets set on fire before every single performance. And it's really all about feeling that and also knowing how to not control it, but how to breathe through it and hone it so that it doesn't just fire off when you get out there. So you have to kind of learn how to, how to manage it in a sense. My mother is the legendary, one of a kind, Felicia Rashad. And what an amazing gift that has been to have a woman with such grace, such clarity, and such love be my mother. <laughs> I, as a young person, was able to see her and appreciate her as my mother, but also as the woman that she is, genuinely. And I was excited for her, and it inspired me. I couldn't wait to become a woman of my own, too. My mother has been one of the greatest gifts of my life, and I know that I share her with everybody. People always tell me like, how does it feel knowing that your mom is all of our moms? I'm like, well, I've never known anything different. Talk about a legend who has inspired me, both as an artist but as a person. I'm gonna go way, 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 way back into black history and talk about Hatshepsut. Hatshepsut was the fifth pharaoh of the 18th dynasty in ancient Egypt. And she was a female, and she ruled as pharaoh, not as queen regent, as pharaoh. She was the longest reigning female pharaoh. She ruled for 20 years. And what we know is under her reign, Egypt flourished artistically, creatively. She resurrected and, and reconstructed all of these um, mortuaries and monuments. One of the most breathtaking archeological uh, sites of Egypt was built under her reign. What do I draw from Hatshepsut? When you have a calling, you come to it. Two artists that I want to talk about who are connected, who I believe are the future, are Chloe and Halley. I discovered Chloe and Halley's music a few years back. When I listened to Chloe and Halley's music, I moved on all four fronts. The rhythms they use, the melodies they use, their melodies tell stories, the journey of the notes that they that they create, it tells a story. Their vocals are amazing, and I just really appreciate the time that I feel that they put into every single piece of music that they create. So I believe that they are our future. As someone who is multifaceted, and I am a musician, and I'm a songwriter, and a producer, and an actor, I'm a storyteller. There are a lot of people that they just get used to one facet of you. So people might just say, oh, you're just an actor. And let them do that. That's not my business. I know what I'm here to do. And so you can't always listen to what people just project onto you. you. Just do what it is you're being called to do. Like Hatshepsut. Somebody could have told you she was just a queen regent, but she's like, no, I'm also the pharaoh. <laughs>